Everybody hear me all right? Yeah. <laughs> Everybody, I want to introduce you to Grayson. Grayson is one of the most recent Gold Star family members from this community. She just recently lost her husband. As you can see, she's carrying his child at this moment. So, thank you again all for coming out. Thank you. Everybody come through and shake her hand, please. Just everybody rotate through and tell her hello. Go ahead. Colin and I's hometown, so it's really special that this was held here and um, to honor, you know, everybody, everybody's sacrifice, but for him this year especially. So thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. So again, like I said this morning, thank everybody for this ride. We're going to head from here over to Gateway, but this is what it's all about. We owe it. To Grayson, we owe it to everybody from this community to remember these guys. These guys died warriors' deaths for this country, for us to be able to ride these motorcycles, cruise around here, do our thing, do our Starbucks, all that. And again, these particular communities, these are guys that operate in the shadows. You don't hear about them on the news. You don't hear about what they're doing. But these are the people that are sacrificing every single month. You know, this community, these communities, these two communities have lost over 15 guys in the last 12 months. You don't hear about it on the news because of what they do is what they do. They ask for that opportunity. They don't ask for this, but their men sign up for it to do it. And when this happens, they're left here with a, a lifetime of dealing with this. And Grayson, congratulations. Freedom is not free. Congratulations. Supporting your husband. Very good. Always. It takes a, a very strong woman to deal with it. Yes. <laughs> he loves being in recovery. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, he didn't want us to know how cool he was. <laughs> <laughs> it's very cool. Very damn cool, yeah. Yeah, yeah. even my own family I've never knew 
all the things because he never talked about it. We didn't call it. We didn't just know very recon humble. Call. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we didn't know recon call. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, maybe next year once baby's out and everything's healthy, you guys can come out and we can do like we did with yes. Tab and Kathleen there, and you can get a chance to kind of experience exactly yeah. what he was all about. Yeah. Because I know it was eye opening for them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't know what you don't know. Exactly. Um, but we will do that. We will continue to do this ride. Yes. We're trying to grow this thing to where we have at least a bike for every KIA from the community. Mm -hmm. You know, we haven't hit that point yet, but this is the first time we've done it here in Missouri. Um, the goal is for us to get that 200 plus that we're sitting at and growing every single month. Um, we'll get there. And uh, next year you'll, like I said, once you're not in the position where you're carrying a little one with you, you can even put the baby, we'll even get a babysitter. Be in my arms, yeah. <laughs> we'll get a babysitter up there. And I'll tell you what, if, if you see the photo that we that we finished the day off with Tab and Kathleen, that'll be the coolest baby photo you'll ever have. <laughs> oh. So, again, just know that people like are standing here right now know exactly what your sacrifice is, and they know, and they appreciate everything that you're going through. Thank and you. I appreciate everything your husband did.